Hey everyone, this is Todd Medina, your authority in MMA and all things concerned. So I got a couple, well more than a couple, but questions a lot lately. And the one I got hit up, I think the majority of the time, were um, like, if I'm in your guard, or somebody's in your guard, and you get them in the arm bar. Say they're able to get that arm out, uh, what else do you have from there? Are there other positions? Do you put it back in the guard? What do you got going on? So we're going to go over three different submissions. If and when somebody's in your guard and you get the arm, the, the arm bar and they pull it out, okay? So again, we're going to go over three submissions from there. Uh, and obviously, these this is for the bottom man, okay? So I'm in his guard and I get stuck in the arm bar. The first one we're going to do is a bicep block. Okay, so for example, I'm going to push with my chest, rip my arm out. What you're going to do is windshield wiper, you're going to switch directions with your torso. Now if you notice what he did, you put, you're going to put the small part of your leg at the, at the crank of the arm, okay, and that, and that knee is down. So he's going to be on the inside hip more, okay. So as he's going to do that, he's going to put the first arm behind the, my, my tricep and the second arm. As he pulls with his arms, he's gonna push with his legs. So I get stuck in this arm bar. Well, I'm able to get it out. As I do, he makes that transformation. Bang, perfect. Now if you notice, the small part of the leg is at the crank of my arm. Now, he's on that inside hip. You want that knee down. Okay, from there, he's gonna go the first hand behind the tricep and the second one. As much as you pull with the arms is as much as you push with the legs. Okay, last one, one more time. Okay, stuck in this thing. Boom, he made the first angle. As I take it out, he's gonna make a second angle. Bang, that's perfect, boom. That knee down, hip down, super important. Behind the tricep, behind the tricep. And now he's really pushing with the, with the legs as he's pulling with the arms. One more time. Okay. Number one, now we're gonna to go to number two. Blah, blah, blah. Uma plata. Okay, so I get stuck in the arm bar. I make pressure, I rip it out. When I do, there you go. He's gonna windshield wiper. And now the big tail of that is he's gonna make that leg transfer outside so I have no foot to grab. Okay? Now he's got that, that knee that's making pressure on my shoulder. Same thing. Now if you notice, this arm here around the, my hips. Not up by my chest, but at my hips where you normally wear a belt. And now let's do is take my hand to my head. Okay, let's go again. Okay. I'm able to get it out. This is perfect. Now, yeah, you don't want to be able to grab that leg, okay? So if he does, he's really going to put pressure on that knee and get that leg out of there. I go, as I'm moving, he's moving. That's gonna cause my, there you go, there you go. Now, say for example, if this guy's strong, and I'm keeping him back, so what he's gonna do is, is make a choke out of it. He's gonna hug my neck, go hand to hand, an S grip or a gable grip, and then not only is he gonna get the shoulder lock, but he's gonna get the choke. Okay, one more time with that one. Okay, now the third submission is instead of hitting the Uma Plata, or if this person's really strong and bearing down, he won't be able to get the Uma Plata, but he's gonna end up with a, a heel hook, or a toe hold, excuse me. Pull that out, rip it. So now, if I'm making pressure back on him, it's gonna make it difficult for him to finish that shoulder lock. So what he's gonna do is his inside arm is gonna grab my toe, Reach around, scissor his legs, and then he's got the, the toe hold. Okay, again. I'm stuck in this. I push with my chest, I pull with my arm. As I move, he moves. But I'm gonna keep pressure back so he can't finish that. So he's gonna set the toe hold up. And with that toe hold, all he's doing when he has it set up, is taking my foot to my butt. Okay, one more time. Oh, 
Okay, so there's three submissions from the guard. James, by the way, thank you very much for being persistent about this question. I've got a couple different people asking me similar questions with this, but this one you were persistent on it, so I'll get back to it. I've got a big laundry list of other questions after hit, so this week we'll, we'll try to get some more of the, out of those. So if you have questions, if you have comments, please hit us up, and I'll get to them as quick as I can. So for right now, if you didn't know, 9-0.